Anyways, we are getting straight into it. Palutena versus Robin. Smash Floor reps in full force tonight. I constantly forget these. I constantly forget Robins in the game. But that's just me. And we will start with both going for neutral B. <laughs> Not much of a surprise considering how good both their neutral Bs are. But hey, you know, I figured at least one of them would go from there first. But uh, here we go. Arcfire gonna catch Palutena after chucking the what's it called? Our reticle. Uh, the Le Levin Sword is just so strong, it's ridiculous. Doesn't get the ledge jump there, unfortunately. Back air off stage. Sniping the jump with auto reticle. Or didn't steal the jump, excuse me, but was able to hit her with auto reticle. Thanks for holding that down for me. I am back. Uh, Woohoo. Arc Thunder going to miss. We got we got the Nairs coming, you know? Well, nice shielding going. Misses the Arc Fire as well, unfortunately. Oh, he got hit with the book, so he couldn't go down to Edge Guard or anything. That's a little ridiculous. The fact that Robin can just generate endless projectiles with, in the form of Thunder and Books and Sword. Just, yeah. Like, adds a whole nother layer to this character. Robin is definitely a projectile master uh, mm -hmm. compared to other characters in the game. Like, she has a lot. Oh, That's such a crazy up. setup. Yeah, there's nowhere to go. Because you have what? Arcfire, uh, the four thunders, her sword, and then her book. That's seven projectiles. Yeah. Seven unique ones. <laughs> oh, oh man, the blast zone saving uh, Hedgy right there. Yeah. Also, eight with L. Oh, oh what a counter! That was a nice counter. Empty Cat playing uh, the big rain right now. Ooh, Thoron sending uh, MC Cat off stage. Yeah, it's uh, it's very clear that Hedgy really knows their Thoron setups because they've hit Thoron more than uh, anyone I've ever seen. Oh yeah, for sure. And then that fire jab is going to be enough to kill. Yeah, the so smash. that gentleman uh, jab on Robin is very strong. Even the rapid jab can kill too. Does it, does it depend on the which book you use last, or does it depend on the A button? I really don't know, to be honest with you. Cool. All right, I feel then. like I've heard somewhere it was based off the last book you used, but I don't know. I don't think it is. Just yeah, it seems like the arc fires here. it seems like the counterplay to that is you do have to parry one of those arc fire hits and then get out of there. And then pray. <laughs> Ooh, good auto reticle. Oh, catching the upy. That was a great oh. play uh, by Empty Cat right there. Just completely dominating at the ledge. Oh, but back here is going to do it because Levin Sword is quite frankly severely underrated. Dude, Levin Sword is just stealing stocks. Absolutely. Just left and right. Yeah. It's a little, it's a little silly. <clears throat> All right. Let's see uh, if there's going to be any sort of character switching or anything like that. I suspect we're pr probably going to get a different Sorry. stage. Or not. No. Wow. You're wrong. Which is actually kind of... I, I, I mean, like, I don't think the stage was the bad part for... Empty cat, you know? I think you just gotta make like a little bit of adjustments in fighting Robin, maybe. Yeah, that's maybe totally fair. That's totally fair. Not getting us caught with the uh, arc fires would definitely help. <clears throat> the arc fire is. Who caught the jump? Move. What's gonna happen? Unfortunately, nothing. Ooh, back so that was really close. Second back here. <coughs> Excuse me. You are excused, my good sir. With Hedgy at that percent we all strive to be at in our lives. 
Well, Auto Reticle actually uh, stopped that projectile just kind of right there. Yeah, it's, it's Auto Reticle is underrated. I don't see enough people talk about it. Which is I mean, insane because that move is good. It, it is. Uh, but it, it's just one of those things where it can just be defeated by movement, you know? So. True. Very much ready for that Thoron. Yep. Locking you down. I mean, so do all of these projectiles by Robin. Wow, that wasn't even the Levin Sword. What was it? What, was it a projectile? Was it no, that was just a regular fair. Like, Robin's got some serious kill power. With or without the sword. <laughs> like, you still got Thorn and Archfire, even when you don't have your Levin Sword. Right. I mean, Robin also has some really tricky movement with all these. Wow, just immediate call out with that back air. He's good. If you just uh, stand there charging, then uh, MT Cat's clearly going to do something about that. Yeah, that was Especially a good. With that shield back air. Yeah. Not much to fear there. Yeah, all of this uh, damage has just been mostly unanswered. So that was a really good you know, set of interactions. I mean, we're pretty much back to even percentages again. And unfortunately, Hedgy just missing that grab, which would have led to a lot of really dangerous stuff. Down tilt. Wow. Not, not expecting down tilt to send uh, in that direction. I was not expecting that off the angle. Surprise, um... Excuse me, I'm surprised, uh... Had you lived to tell the tale of that off me. Alright, Empty Cat going for that ledge trump punish. It didn't quite work out, and then uh Hedgy's able to pick up the whole stock after that. <clears throat> counter, not gonna counter anything. He reads the wall technically with that arc fire. Yeah, that was a really good interaction for Hedgy there. Oh my god, the shield almost breaking all oh, my goodness. Oh my god. If that dare had connected, that would have been the end of Hedgy's second stock. But, uh, that is the oh, end of we had lag at the end stock. there. Yeah, I mean, it lagged after the, the hit, so... If anything, that was just going to make it easier for them to DI, but, like, neither here nor there. Water under the bridge, you know? You know, you know. And it looks like we were able to update the oh, I got... GG appropriately because we now have game five. Yep. Yeah, I'm yep. just going to... The bot you incorrectly said five. that the set was over. Yeah, I, I had... Uh, it still said best of three. I'm going to fix that real quick. Uh, oh, Hold they're on. getting right into game three. I will do the commentating while you fix your bot. Uh, is this town city? It is town. Okay. All right, and we're updated. We're good. Sweet. But uh, opting for a lot of town and cities <clears throat> this time. We have to see if MT Cat can uh, make any adjustments here, because uh, he's that last game especially, like he was down by two when he lost. So maybe uh, Hedge is making more adjustments here, as we see double arc fire into back air. Yeah, I mean, that was just a lot of... Unable to pick up that 11 sword there. Ooh, good win box. Ooh. Let's see here. Gets off the ledge by rolling a couple times, which is always good. Yeah, I mean, what I think we're, we're seeing the problem is for Empty Cat is uh, kind of just this inability to get a stock. If that makes sense. Like, they get a ton of really good combos, low and mid percents. But then they get to, like, 120% or so, whatever. And it gets a little bit harder to uh, take those stocks. At least that's what we were seeing last game. So but Not impossible, as we just saw right there. But I understand what you mean. Yeah. I don't know. Anything that uh, Empty Cat can do to take the stocks sooner, or even at, like, a reliable percentage... Yeah is what is required because as we're seeing by Hedgy, uh they're taking stocks 
super oh quickly. God, he does have a jump. That was oh, a great reflection. Capitalized. He was able to capitalize off that reflect. That would have been ridiculous. Wow. Levin Sword just traded with an invincible move. Fair enough. <laughs> All right, we're starting to see that reflection come out more, and I think that's a really good idea. You know, make Robin sweat a little bit for throwing out some of those hitboxes. Um, or maybe even if they counter a Levin Sword hit, because that would for sure spell doom. Absolutely. Air dodge into the platform to get another jump back. Great spike. Down air. <clears throat> and uh, seems MT Cat making those adjustments mid game. Yeah. M2 Cat is definitely, uh, sorry, MT Cat, not M2 Cat. <laughs> U2K? <laughs> yeah. MT Cat has, has uh, definitely figured out what needs to be done. Let's just see if he can keep it going. Oh, uh, great DI sword. there. Eleven Sword Don't hit not. almost killed. So even just that bare hit of that allowed them to not only recover, but then gain stage control for free. Um, fortunately, that was a bad Thoron, and uh, I'd say it's bad. It's just uh, it was. Cat was ready for it. I, I, uh, I it didn't see, seem like, like the right it time. Work. It didn't seem like the right time to me. Maybe Hedgy was trying to read something. Yeah. Oh, trying to spike with Elwin. That's the first time we've seen that all night. No, we've tried to see that before. We, they tried to go for it before. Yeah. Ledge canceling with that power all right. He's just, just thundered. I mean, this is a hundred. Cat. Yeah. Technically on his tournament stock. Granted, Hedgy at 125, but it still could be doomed for MT Cat here. And the book is gone. The Levin Sword isn't yet. Oh, now it is. And the jab is going to stall enough so Robin can get the sword back. Dash attack will not be enough right now. Dodges the explosive flame. Good roll. Again, look at Robin's movement. It's just so tricky. Oh, wasn't able to get the up tilt. Robin now has a Thoron. And Levin Great Sword. Great back air. will connect and take out Hedgy. All right, MT Cat, uh, still in the set on the board. Uh, will we see a reverse 3-0, or will uh, Hedgy take the set in one of the next possible games? We saw MT Cat making the adjustments needed to bring this like to a more commanding victory, but Hedgy still not done adjusting. Very easily was bringing that back at the end. All right, selections. That's definitely a different stage this time. No doubt. Uh, money on uh, Kalos. I don't know. I have no idea. Three. Smashville. Actually, this is probably a really good pick for Robin. Um, because, you know, you can just kill Palutena sooner. Yeah, Palu will die in like 90. It's a Levin Sword. And there's not much you can do about it. But to see, the Laren lies the problem actually landing a Levin Sword hit. Currently, MT Cat at 0% unanswered. Yeah, this is some great adaptation we're seeing. 96, 114, 2, 127. Oh, I thought. like at an auction here just saying numbers. <laughs> I mean, uh, I thought instead of that back air, we were going to see a down air there for a little spike. But, uh, well, the pivot oh, grab not thunder. working. Well, it doesn't get that arc thunder set off for the platform. Levin Sword trying to tie this up a little bit. Insane Yo, that shield pressure, book might I add. Did so much shield uh, pressure. Oh my god, he's dead. But, like, do you see what I was talking about last game, though? Like, Hedgy got up to, like, 140, and then, like, it was very difficult to get in again. Yeah. Got in there to get the up smash, but it's... I see your point. 
Good thing thing, like pressure. Hedgy's always applying in terms of projectiles and shield pressure and just pressure all together. It's just tough. <laughs> Oh, good, good uh, evasion there, that Nosferatu. Ooh, trading projectiles there. Somehow I think that was a better trade for uh, Hedgy instead of uh, Empty Cat. Well, yeah, because Hedgy maintained stage control. Well, I meant just because Arc Thunder did more damage than, than uh, Firework. Mm. But that too. Yeah. Alright, that was a really interesting air dodge, but it actually worked out really well. Um... This is the back air there, oh. just barely. Down smash doing an insane amount of shield damage. Probably oh. gonna throw on very soon. Uh, it was like literally half the shield. Yeah, that was yeah. a great Thoron. It hits just everywhere. You're on the other side of the stage, you're not safe. Other side is like the. Oh no! I think that was supposed to be a ledge trump there. Uh, and they weren't was. looking at their character, so they just didn't oh, see that no. happen. Hedgy now healed up to less than kill percent. Yeah. Empty Cat could definitely shake this off, but uh, it's going to be quite the mental battle and the battle in the game to just try and win this game. As Empty Cat, as I forgot to mention earlier, is on his tournament stock. That is true. Again, we're just seeing these good uh, oh. little maneuvers here to just maintain... That's death. Uh, yeah, yeah, dude, that's it, dude. Th those arc fires are that's unbelievably dangerous.